Hello, my name is Kyle Catarat. I'm an instructor here at Ames Community College for the Auto Collision Repair and Finishing Program. Um, I would like to thank you in the consideration for the Collision Repair Education Foundation's grant process for the school. Uh, we are a tier one school, but that being said, we are always looking for ways to improve and continue our tier one status. Um, allow me to take you for a tour around the shop and the classroom. As we're standing here, you can see a little bit of our mess. We are uh, working on doing some curriculum updates. And we got plenty of training job aids on the walls, computers for students, and this is where the students do all their book work and paperwork for their icon. So let's go ahead and head out to the shop for a tour. As we head through the cattle chute, we'll see our tool crib on the right. This is where we will house some of our tools and equipment that are maybe larger items or one or two quantity items. Turn out into the shop. We can see that we have our clean area here, and this is a fully curtained off area. We keep this clean for aluminum repair as well as any sort of sanding, grinding we have to do to really keep the shop as clean as possible. One of our student projects sitting here in the middle. This was a full, complete repaint collision repair and hail repair. As we walk through this door, we're going to be getting into our welding lab. This is where we provide welding training and certification for our students in steel, silicon bronze, and aluminum. Just to the left of the welding bays, we have our paint boots. These are full bait boots, full downdraft boots. Um, we run these boots whenever we do any sort of spray operation. In between the two boots, we have our mixing room. This is where the students will mix and make any sort of product, clear coat, base coat, primer, or sealers that they need. As we walk into our second paint booth, they're the exact same paint booth, left to right. Both of them are full down draft big boots. Come out here to the end of the shop, and this is where we will have some of our other areas for storage, parts carts, um, additional equipment, materials, parts. In bays 9 and 10, we have our frame racks here, our uh, Goliath frame rack here, as well as our Carliner frame rack. Both of these frame racks are measuring systems, both on the robotic arm as well as the laser system. Some of the other bays at the shop with some other projects such as the bed that we use for dent repair. Once again, we'd like to thank you for your consideration in helping us with the grant and continuing our continuing improvement on our tier one school status. We are always looking for ways to improve and a few of the things that would benefit our students here would be a Evo measuring system clamping system. Also, if possible, or at all, would be our towers. We have a single tower that runs for this car liner system for a pulling tower. An additional tower would be a great benefit for the student. Uh, once again, I'd like to thank you for your continued support for the industry as well as our students, and uh, have a great day.